I want you all to understand that there has been a lot of speculations out there that Quavo has finally joined Mob Ties. That Quavo right now is a part of Mob Ties, and that's why you know he's trying to defend the Prince family and he's trying to defend the Mob Ties over the takeoff situation. And these are wars on the streets. You get what I'm saying? But before we get into it, make sure you smash that like button, make sure you subscribe, turn on the notification bell so you get notified whenever I drop a new video. Remember, this video is for entertainment and educational purposes is only so everything is allegedly you get what i'm saying but let's get straight into this because you know it's about to go crazy you know come to think of it ever since take off that we are getting to like seven months now that take off that you know he's like getting to yay that take off lost his life in houston and nothing has been done about it right we didn't know what happened you know there's been a lot of speculations that it was an accident it was a setup it was a sacrifice it was these and it was there we don't know for sure what really happened to take off right but all we know that take off died over senseless violence in houston under the watch of the prince family you get what i'm saying and these you know speculations has been going crazy but what's more crazy is that after you know the, the the prosecution say that you know quavo refused to help them to get justice for takeoff that quavo refused to cooperate with them to get justice for takeoff that's when it started going crazy you get what i'm saying and a lot more people started saying on social media that you know quavo finally joined mob ties that quavo is a part of mob ties a lot more people are saying that you know quavo did this and Quavo did that and a lot of people are saying that Quavo sacrificed takeoff that he was an industry sacrifice but finally you know people are saying that Quavo is a part of mob ties that Quavo allegedly has signed to mob ties that's why he's protecting the image of the prince family and the image of mob ties and what more can i say this is really crazy because i don't know what else to believe because Quavo is making it more hard and making it more difficult for us to put a finger on what really happened to take off you get what i'm saying now you start thinking that every rumors and every speculations and conspiracy theories that we've been hearing on social media about what really happened to take off we start thinking that these are all true because the little brother Quavo refused to do something about it and this is a little bit more crazy because i can't really put my finger across what this young man is trying to do because at the end of the day we have to understand that you know what we see on social media and what we hear on the news are all censored you get what i'm saying it's all censored if it's not censored you know we're not going to hear it and that's why i told you all that you know the media is trying as much as possible to hide the truth from us get what i'm saying they are trying as much as possible to hide the truth from us if you say something crazy if you expose some kind of sensitive information out here you know you're gonna get banned like they're gonna cancel you you get what i'm saying they don't want people to know the truth they don't want people to know what's really happening out there especially in the music industry and right here we are dealing with the issue and the situation of takeoff and quavo decent offset for trying to expose the prince family and forgetting the energy that he's supposed to be putting along to the people that really got take off you know to the situation that take off is right now you get what i'm saying and the world in the street is saying that j prince junior mob ties is linking up with quavo secretly that's the words on the street allegedly you get what i'm saying they say that j prince junior mob ties is linking up with quavo allegedly because quavo is now part of the mob ties and i'm not really surprised and i will tell you all why i'm not surprised if this happens to be true i'll tell you why i'm not surprised but before we get into it make sure you all are smashing that like button if you are new to the channel make sure you subscribe to the channel now i'll tell you why i'm not surprised at the end of the day we have to understand that you know some people that say they love you even though they are family even though they are friends at the end of the day they are just doing it for their own selfish interest you get what i'm saying because at the end of the day after take off that we've seen the record level selling the catalog of the migos for over 300 million dollars cashing out real big time because you know the streaming numbers started going up and everything started going up right 
So at the end of the day, allegedly it turned to be a business. You get what I'm saying? It turns out to be a business. And right here we have uh, Quavo looking at the business and looking at getting justice. So I think that, you know, in my own opinion that, you know, Quavo is choosing the business over getting justice. You all tell me what you think in the comment section because it can be more truer than this. You get what I'm saying? Quavo is looking at the business, looking at the money, looking at his fame, looking at maintaining the position that he has in the music industry and with the record label and all their secret contracts that they are signing with these record labels, right? He is looking at it and he is choosing the business and the money over takeoff justice you get what i'm saying so that's why i say if you're a rapper and you're watching this video right now you need to make sure you look out for yourself you get what i'm saying make sure you look out for yourself because a lot more people that you are calling family you know yeah this is my family you know these are these and these are that they're not gonna snitch in me they're standing by me and stuff like that i'll tell you the truth when you die they're gonna make money off your name they're not gonna give a f about getting justice for you they're going to turn it out to be a cash out moment. So that's why you're going to make sure that you protect yourself and stay alive as much as possible. You get what I'm saying? You're going to make sure you protect yourself and stay alive as much as possible. You can put your protection on another man's hand. You can't even trust the person nearest to you. And that's why if you're looking at these rappers, you know, claiming that they are street dudes, you know, they are street ninjas, you know, looking at them saying that they, they are this and they are that, they are gangsters, you know, they are not none of that. You get what I'm saying? Because real gangsters in the street knows that the only people that they can trust is themselves. You get what I'm saying? The only person they can trust is themselves. Because whatever you do to yourself, you own it to yourselves. You can't trust the person next to you to put the protection of your life in the person's hand. Because I'm thinking this, right? If Takeoff wasn't listening to Quavo, you know, like Quavo always said that, you know, Takeoff always listens to him, never argues with him and stuff like that. Anything he said that, you know, Takeoff is good with it. I think that's what got Takeoff killed. No disrespect. You get what I'm saying? Because if he goes ahead to stop listening to Quavo, he would have been alive today. Because I think that, you know, if he doesn't listen to Quavo, just like Offset, he wouldn't be in that position. He would have been moving to Houston with his own protection. You get what I'm saying? He would have been moving to Houston with his own protection. He would have, you know, maybe be sitting elsewhere when Quavo was playing the dice. Because I know if Offset was in that position, Offset would be sitting elsewhere, right? Somewhere like, you know, real lonely in that particular bowling alley. Maybe taking a chair or sitting elsewhere with a girl and stuff like that. You know, just chilling out and watching what's going on over there so that no matter what happens it's not gonna touch you first you're gonna be the first person to run you know take off would have still been alive but you know rest in peace to take off no disrespect uh, uh justice for take off you know you all go under the comment section and type justice for take off because take off really needs to get justice because he's not just gonna die like that and we've seen you know quavo turning out to be all about business and music industry which is really crazy but remember this video is for entertainment and educational purposes only so everything remains allegedly you get what i'm saying don't forget to smash that like button don't forget to subscribe turn on the notification bell so you all get notified whenever i drop a new video and if you are feeling generous you can send a super thanks to the channel or you can subscribe to the channel's membership i'm gonna give you a special shout out you get what i'm saying see you guys on the next clip